Hey, 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 Stubby here. Today, we're going on an adventure. And I didn't die. Yeah, let's go. Hey guys, today we are starting with the sluice. I uh, did get us upgraded to the iron one. It's supposed to be uh, automate the input output. I gotta figure that one out. The pipes didn't seem to work, or I don't understand how to use the pipes, so I'm gonna play with it or get to uh, hoppers. All right, so with that, I did learn. The next step for these chunks is if you do this recipe right here and get the clusters, we can run the clusters up to our jar and basically for half the cost, make an ingot. Anything that saves resources is awesome or roughing it. Um, I did do some exploration. I uh, found a couple of new underwater monuments over here. I tried to get to them. Uh, dang, almost died. Running out of breath. Found a bunch of ships around. And it was nice. Uh, I think it knocked out a couple extra quests. Found dive gear. A uh, million records. If you can see. <laughs> I found quite a bit. Um, and then I got this island. I, I spent a lot of time in my boat honestly just circling around it trying to think about how I wanted to go forward what our best plan was for the look of it and I came down to two choices originally I was thinking about just getting rid of everything flattening it out putting all the dirt in a nice flat thing but I don't know if there's enough dirt to cover up the island below it um, but we can always figure that out so that's option number one. Make a bigger island. Make a flat island. It'll be okay. Option number two. We make a floating base around the island. Uh, Waterworld-esque, for those that have seen the old Kevin Costner movie. Um, basically a giant floating base around it. And we'll put uh, all the wood coming off of it and we can expand as we need it in the beginning we'll start would start with just just the platform eventually we could add walls decorations lookout towers um, layers um, if we did that I'd like to actually get a pretty decent size to make it look really cool with rooms and buildings and whatnot and then the island in the middle and the theme essentially would be like oh we're lost at sea it's a water world there's no land and we found this magical land and we're trying to protect it from all these other explorers out here uh, now with either one of those I am NOT a beautiful builder I'm trying to learn working on it getting better ask me to build a square I'll do a good square <laughs> but I will do my best on either one so I do want to hear from you guys what do you want to see you want to see a flat island or do you want to see a floating base um, let me know, and the next episode, we should hopefully be starting on progress towards whichever one you guys want to see. And one more of these little iron things. I want to get this mesh upgraded. Uh, nope, I need you back. I just want iron. Give me iron. Got it. All right. And it's already getting dark again. Boom. Boom, 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 boom. Climbing up here. Oh, if you're using this, I don't have the pipe set up for the thing, so it just shoots it out on the ground. So be ready for that. And all that's going. Let's go pick up this mesh. Go 
upgrade it. Sleep. And mesh. So let's see what we need. Oh, we don't even need the other one. Uh, so a string and four six. Got it. So we need one, two, three, four, and I pretty sure I have string. One, two, three, four, four, six, string. Got it. Iron Mesh. Uh, I was really hoping that would have been a quest. Yeah, well, it was worth a try. And let's go test it out. How are we doing? 7.2, 6 6.6, yeah. It's doing alright. And we're also going to want to do some sand, so let's switch it up, get some sand going. I think gold is the next tier up. Yay, yeah, gold chunks. All right, and while that's going, what other quests do we got? Can we work on? So, getting started one. I don't know if there's any more chain lanes out here. Uh, I did get something for this animals one. So we'll go to check that out. I'll, I'll show you guys that. I found it in my explorations. Uh, let's see, exploration. Paintings are, are only one way, so if you forget to take an overworld painting with you, well, it's over. Painting. End painting overworld. Oh, that's kind of cool. Interesting. Way to transport. Uh, found in the nether. Found on rafts and structures underwater. Can be found in structures, rafts in the ocean, underwater, and the nether. And can be found in structures, blah, 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 blah. So, got a few more of those. What is this? Break some items into raw material, huh? Oh, okay. Break down, that's nice. Iron. And how do we build this? Need a bunch of iron. Got it. Let's talk about what we don't have. A bunch of iron. All right. Keep looking at these quests. Uh, digital storage. Don't have the power for, so I'm not super worried about that one. Flux network. We'll have to get the flux test going for that. Industrial immersive. It's going to look good. Thermal. Need the power. And power. Solar panels. What do we need? We need the starter one. I need some dielectric paste capacitors. So what is this? Blaze powder. Another rack. All right, we'll get there. We'll get the power. It, it'll be a thing. I see it. Draconic. We're going to build a massive draconic generator. Or uh, fusion blood magic. Botania is going to be fun. We're going to go have an adventure. Uh, in Mystical agriculture will probably look like be a main source of materials for us because it's easier to grow flowers than it is to sit in front of the sieve. We got the mist. We got a bunch of little things to make. Uh, mob farm, which is something we should do quickly. So as soon as we get a concept for what we want to do on the base design, we'll do a mob farm. Uh, mini utilities, solar panel controller, generates power when attached. Don't have the resources. Thanks. Storage drums, placer, miner. Okay. Integrated dynamics and our end game, which is singularity crazy. All right. So, what is this crazy thing we found? Well, if you guys have played modded Minecraft for a while, you've probably used Cursed Earth. I've used Cursed Earth, Cursed Earth in quite a few packs. I've loved it. it. Makes for easy mobs farms. What did I find? Never heard of this before. Blessed Earth. Spawns passive mobs. Uh, yes, this area would spawn mobs. 
it can, possibly. Or we could just go spawn passive mobs. So we take a few pieces of dirt off, make a little platform, put a fence around it, put that on there, and voila, passive mobs. Uh, now then, blessed. There was another one. What was it? At mini. It was so it was cursed, blessed, and blurst. This one just spawns everything. This one will spawn passive, and this one will spawn hostile. So the cursor is really cool, but you can build a small mob farm, put some conveyors on it, and boom. Just spawn like crazy. Get your resources like crazy. And that will be the hope that we can get there quickly. Until that point, we're going to have to do some sort of mob farm. If we can get the iron going, we'll be able to maybe make a large drop one, let them land on some spikes. Uh, if you look under here, we have other options. We can do the spikes, which, <clears throat> excuse me, like the wood won't kill. It just brings them down to one heart. Uh, this one will kill. This one drops experience. This one will drop player kill specific items. Uh, so on and so on. So we can work our way through all those and check them out. Item pipes. Oh yeah, I forgot about those. Iron. Don't need iron. Uh what else we got? Mega torch, feral flare. So we got some stuff. We got some things to work for. It's cobble gen. That's actually a lot easier than I thought it would be. Gotta be the metal bucket, so I think we should try for it. And then you can make infinite lava. Um, yeah, that's something that might come sooner rather than later because I'm pretty sure I have that. I need to get three more iron and we could run through it. Come here, Mr. Drown. I need to fight something. I have yet to fight a hostile mob. Oh, there's a few of them. Oh! My oxygen! Oh! That was a bad spot. Magma! Dude, I was like swimming along. I was like, why am I all of a sudden getting sucked? Oh, yeah. That's a thing. That's cool. It looks cool under there. Oh, I can't wait till we can go down there. Come here, guy. I'm gonna die. Oh, I made it. <laughs> I wanted to fight him. It didn't work out. Don't come up for some reason. But let's go sluice. Alright, so what else can we do? Oh. Let's look at these tempered glass recipes. Obsol, silver, aluminum. Oh. So that would make it even more? Is there an iron one? There is. Oh, wait. 
really not a difference then. Okay. Not much of a difference. Okay. Worth checking out. And we'll go over here. We have a lot of a lot of repetition, a lot of stuff in the beginning of this pack. Insufficient resources because I didn't build it because I'm a ding dong. There you go. Can't sleep yet. Boom, 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 boom. I think maybe bring that up here for now with an infinite water source <laughs> right here. Make life a little bit quicker. No, this is a. I like this pack. It it's not super straightforward. It's not uh, it's linear in the quest. It's it's still very kitchen sink. I mean, there's tiers you got to get through. Progression, I guess to say. Uh, like you know, wood to iron and so on. But I just for the quest purposes. But if I wanted to sit here and hammer out all the iron, I could go build the iron spikes. I could go build pipes I can I can skip through it so I, it, it's making it a little more free play uh, a little more random as how we're gonna progress but it's kind of nice is that uh, they, they, their packs are usually well thought out um, it definitely gives us room to have fun we don't have a constraint we don't have to build specifically to one item one progress point we can just build. I already forgot what I said I was working for, so that always helps, right? Item trash can. I'm going to go ahead and work on that one too. It is some cobble. Stone. From a chest. One, two, three. That one in there. Do we have mini coal? Not seeing the mini coals. Yep, no well. One more. All right, it should be that, that. Hey, we got a trash can. Now I have a clean way to get rid of all of these dang discs. What do we get out of that? Birch top roof. Interesting. Not quite sure how we're going to use that. It's got a rhyme reason in a way. And that's, I mean, that's really going to be the extent of what we're doing. Go for a swim. Check out this really cool water. Oh, you know what we could do? We could go test out this dive equipment I got. Let's go do it. Mining fatigue and something else. So you get mining fatigue from being in the water. Interesting. Slowness and mining fatigue. That's the consequences of being in the water. Right. So 
go check it out. I don't have any oxygen, so it's not really going to help us with time underwater, but I think it will help us with... What do I have on? So that goes off. I'll need that. I'll need that. And there's an oxygen tank around there somewhere. Blind. There it is. Enchanted golden apple. Boom, boom. Look at that. Let's go swimming. Let's see what happens. 75, 72. So let's just count this out. 1, 2, 3. Yeah, so it actually gives us the full time. That's that's a nice change. We're not having any repercussions. Oh, dude, let's go check out that temple now then. Oh, that's going to be rough. That's going to be quick. You know what? Let's do it. I think I can at least make it down and back up in my 70 seconds. <laughs> I hope. I hope. I swear it wasn't that far down. We'll find out. Let's go. Let's end this, uh, end this episode on a cool little exploration binge. And in between episodes, uh, do some sluicing. Try to do some more exploration. And hopefully I get I get some combat comments. Uh, you know, hopefully pretty pretty quick. As a uh, Let's see, it's right over to the left. And we should be right above it, so let's go. Oh! That's a Guardian's fun. There's a very good chance we're going to die. Don't want to end this episode on my death, but it is what it is. Let's go see what's in here. Uh, Guardian. Swim! Swim to freedom! Run! Run! <laughs> we made it! We made it! Ah! Flying tridents! Ah! Ow! Ah! Leave me alone, tridents! Run! Ah! What all do we get? We got some stuff. Let's go check it out. Come flying in here, drifting to a stop like uh Alright, what do we get? We got some inferior how much do we need? There's a quest. Yeah. Look at that. Unlocked ourselves some copper. And a basic jetpack because that's very important uh, this early in the game with no fuel. Uh, rotten flesh, I probably just didn't get enough. I know that is a quest. Uh, in one of these, I feel like I saw a quest. Want me to do things? One shy, of course. All right, uh, so we got a jetpack. We got so rotten flesh, a mob soul, some inferium. Upgrades, some prismarine, and this treasure bag. 
which had some gold, some gold, and a gold shovel. Not going to complain about resources. Not at all. Wait. I think that's enough to do the mesh. Gold mesh? It is. Let's go make a gold mesh. Alright. We can do it. Can make this. Uh, I need one of those. And one of those. Gold. And... I keep thinking it's going to be a quest, but it's not. So, gravel gives us a 64% chance for iron. Amazing. Uh, dust hooks up on redstone, gold, okay. Sand, 53% iron. That's more into the copper. Netherrack. Basalt. Yeah, so gravel. Dude, gravel is going to be the thing. Check this out. We just upped our iron game. Like, that and that. Watch this. Iron. One, two, three. I have no iron. I got no iron. See how cocky I got? I was like, this is what's going to happen. And it doesn't happen. Got neither. So. <laughs> Alright, so I have a huge, way better chance for iron, and I'm still not going to get any iron. It hates me. Oh my goodness, it hates me. Yeah. Alright. Anyway, <laughs> that was fun. I'm glad we didn't die. It was a cool little adventure. Uh, there is nothing in one of these chests. So we're going to put our diving gear in it. Boom, boom, boom. Alright. And boom. All right, guys, so I'm going to go ahead and sign off here. Look forward to reading your comments. Hopefully we can uh, get a building plan. I'm going to chop down some trees and do some sluicing. Stubby out.